Hello everyone, Carson here. Thank you for tuning back into my YouTube channel. And we have another mystery kit loop and a giveaway this time. There's a giveaway from DEK. All right, so welcome to the DEK Designs Mystery Loop and Giveaway. Thank you for stopping by to check out how I'm going to use the main mystery kit in my planner. After watching my video, make sure you click on, click the link in my description so you can go to the next person in our loop so you can see how other people in the loop have used their kits. I like watching all of the videos to see how everyone used the kit. Um, mystery subscription spots open up today, the day I'm posting this on the 15th, at 9 a.m. Uh, Central Time. If you are interested in signing up for next month's kit, make sure you visit the website on the 15th and follow them on Instagram so you can see all the other releases that are going to be coming up as well. To enter into the giveaway for a chance to win May's kit for free, comment below with your favorite spring food slash treat. Either or or both if you want. And subscribe to my channel. I will pick a winner on May 24th, so make sure to pay attention to your notifications on that day. Enter your name multiple times by following this different loop in the giveaways and putting your name on each one. All right, so I am going to show you what comes in the subscription kits. It's the same every single month. And I am going to um, show you how I'm planning in this because I have a way I'm gonna plan in this um, plan with me. And it's different than I've done my previous loops or it's basically different how I've done any spread. I want to do something different. So with the mystery kit subscription, it's only $16, all right? You get an eight sheet kit, six uh, sheets of those are foiled, one sheet foil date dots and a mystery item, all that's for $16. You get more stickers in here. Their regular release is 23. So keep that in mind if you want to know, you know, if it's worth it or anything, it's always worth it. I say it every time I do one of these videos. So yeah, let's get started. So this is the May mystery kit and this is the mystery item and this is really pretty gold foil dandelions so pretty all right so we have this right here i love the color scheme of this and so here we go we got your eight full boxes right here and then this one has like the different designs from each sticker that's on here really pretty and then we have this one right here the weekend banner you have these three um, frames right here and here's your date dots date hearts right here and you get two more full boxes you have the monday through sunday and you have these squares right there all in all you get 14 full boxes so you can spread this out over two weeks if you wanted to um or you could put them all on one spread which is what i plan to do which i've never done before so we're gonna see all right and this one right here, this is your day headers. I always appreciate how DEK slides the day over. <laughs> so each um, day heart can fit with no problem. And you have your two sticker strips right here, um, two sets rather, of your sticker strips right there. And then you have your check boxes and your checklist. You get five checklists eight check boxes, so you can put one on each day of the week and then have one over to the side if you want on your notes section. You have some page flags. You get these little hexagons right here. And then you have these right there. And then you have this sheet right here. You have the scalloped headers, you have the bow headers, you have these scalloped half circles, and you get the skinnier um, sticker strips. With the kit that comes like this, you almost don't need washi because you get Essentially, you get eight sticker strips. So that can easily take the place of washi if you want. And then we have the glitter headers and you have your to-do today, meals, work, this week, next week, and exercise. And you have two blank ones. And then you have this sheet right here. These are your functional boxes that are foiled. There, there are seven foiled sheets in this um, May mystery kit. And then we have four uh, full boxes right here of the dolls. And then we have this right here. You can use this for like walking or exercise. You have your grocery, um, which I like to use for my grocery hauls. You have like the trash Eve and all of that stuff. You can just use this for meal planning, which I don't typically do meal planning too much. I plan the meals I'm gonna get, but I just don't know what day I'm gonna have them on. So there's that sheet right there. And this sheet does not come with your um, 
with the regular releases. This sheet is completely exclusive to the mystery kit. And then we have the deco. Oh my God, it's a doggy. It's like a little beagle, how cute. All right, so I am going to open up my planner and I'm gonna kind of walk you guys through how I plan on doing this and then I'm going to decorate, but I'm gonna speed this up, okay? So this was the last loop I did. And we are going to be, I would be doing this for the 15th, the week of the 15th. I'm going to be gone that week and I didn't want to plan it that week. All right. Um, but I'm going to use this for the week of the, oh, let me zoom out. The week of the 20th. Okay. So the day you guys are seeing this, when I'm decorating, it'll be up the week after. So I got some washi. I don't even know how I'm going to use this washi. We'll see. But I got some washi. Um that I thought matched really well. We have this gold with this plaid. I thought the color schemes in that went really well. And we have some blue stardust, which, I mean, <laughs> and we have some brown gold stardust. And then I picked out this, these rolls right here, which I thought went really well with that. So here is my thoughts on how I'm going to actually decorate this. All right. So you guys know, if you know anything about me, you know, I always plan. Um, let's look at how I did this, right? So you guys know I did the full seven boxes across, right? Typically how I always do my spreads. I'm going to do that this time. All right. With the full seven, but I'm also going to put seven down here. We're going to get a lot of use out of these stickers. And then I'm going to show you how many I have left over and it'll let you know just how much you're getting for the value you're getting for the amount of money you're spending because you're spending a very little amount of money for a lot of stickers, which to me is a win-win. All right, so but how I typically know, I always know I'm going to do the headers first, so I always take out this sheet first, right? And then I take out this sheet because the numbers need to go on there, right? So I always take out that sheet first, and then the second sheet I always take out are like the full boxes. And typically, if I were using, if I were splitting this up over two weeks, I would kind of pick and choose which ones um, I was gonna use, but since I'm going to be using every single one of these, um, I'm gonna put, leave that out there as well. And then I always use these headers, always, and I am gonna use these, and I'm gonna try to use some deco, and I'm gonna use these. So I always use these because they're decor, but they're functional. So, and then the checklist as well. And then we got some deco here, and I'm gonna to try to get some of these in. If not, that's okay. My goal is to use these sticker strips. So I'm not even thinking about using the washi first. I'm thinking about using the sticker strips because I wanna focus on the kit more so than the washi, all right? So let's get started. So the next thing I'm going to do is kind of just um, speed this up and I'll be back to give you the end. Then we're going to see if the end result ends up how I think I'm going to do it or if it's going to be a little bit different. But either way, we're going to get started with this. touch the washi. I'm not, not even mad at it. So let's, let's zoom out a little bit so we can see. Okay. So this is jam packed. Okay. Top to bottom. <laughs> um, 
left to right, just, you know, just full of cup. That's bugging me because I don't. All right. So here is how I did the entire spread. And like I said, I've never done, I never use these lines anyway. So them being covered up is not a big deal to me. Um, I have more than enough room to plan the things that I plan. I do have a notebook for daily things if this runs over, but I pretty much like this to be my creativity and whatnot. So this is what I use. And I use a lot of sugars, but I still have some left over. Just letting you guys know that even if you decorate like this, okay? I'm gonna show you what I have left over. So I did not use any of the checklist right here. I didn't use any of the page flags and I didn't use any of these, okay? So I still have all of these glitter headers left and I have some work ones. Um, and then I have like next week work and all that stuff, which I don't put any work related stuff in this planner. Um, I have a separate, completely separate planner for that. And then I used quite a few of these boxes, but I didn't use any of the habit tracking ones. I probably will just use these in my wellness planner. I emptied that sheet. <laughs> this one got just about emptied and I saved these. When I cut them, I just save them. There's no need to throw them out. And then, um, I use these two, the Trash Eve, because my blue can is coming this week, the week this is, and my trash. And then um, there's laundry, right? Actually, the laundry, the laundry can go right there, okay? And I will be doing a grocery order. I just don't know what day, because I'm planning this so far in advance. So I will save that for that week. And then I use some deco. And then I pretty much saved this for like my journal. And then I did not use any of these and I still have all of these. Um, I like using these, like if there's another kit that I'm using for another brand and it doesn't come with date hearts, then I have that. And that is pretty much everything. So, I mean, you get all of this for $16. The trade off is that you don't know what it looks like until you get it. But I think for only $16, I mean, it's not bad. Oh, I didn't use the mystery item either. I'm gonna save that as well. But that is everything. I really enjoy decorating this spread. It's, I haven't done anything like this like with putting all of these full boxes down, but I love how it turned out. And yeah, so don't forget to follow, go through the loop, okay? And comment your favorite spring snack uh, slash food and follow everyone and you need to comment on everybody's video, okay? In order to be qualified for the giveaway. All right, good luck to everyone who's entering and I will see you all next time, bye.